All right, today we're gonna to be making a seared salmon with a lemon dill cream sauce. So to get started, you're gonna to wanna to take two six to eight ounce salmon fillets with the skin on and begin to season with a little bit of salt, pepper, and garlic powder. Before seasoning the skin, just make sure to pat it down with paper towel so that it's nice and dry, and then seasoning with just salt and pepper. Then we're gonna take three garlic cloves and we're gonna make a fine mince out of this as it's going to be going into our sauce. All right, now it's time to chop up some fresh dill. So get yourself a handful worth with the stems removed and then we're gonna want a fine chop, enough to make about three tablespoons worth. Now I would suggest using fresh dill as it really brightens up the dish, but if you don't have any on hand, you can also use dried dill and again, use about three tablespoons worth. Final item for prep is just the zest of one lemon and then we are also gonna juice this lemon and then we're ready to make the sauce. To start, you're gonna take a medium fry pan and we're gonna have this on medium heat and put in about two to three tablespoons of olive oil and begin to heat that up and then add one tablespoon of butter and melt that down. Once the butter is fully melted, now we're gonna add in the minced garlic from earlier and we're gonna saute for about 30 seconds. We want the garlic to start to brown but not burn as that's gonna turn our sauce bitter. Then we're gonna add our lemon juice from earlier and let this simmer for a few seconds before adding a cup of heavy cream. We're gonna turn the heat a little bit higher to medium high and bring this to a simmer for a few minutes just until this mixture has started to thicken. Now you're gonna know the sauce is ready when you begin to see streaks in the pan when running a spatula or spoon through it. This takes about four to five minutes and afterwards you're gonna turn the heat to low and add the dill from earlier. Begin to incorporate the dill into the sauce and then we're gonna add the lemon zest from earlier and let this cook for another two minutes just so those flavors can mend together. Afterwards, taste for final seasonings in which I'm adding pepper and then a little bit of salt. Now our last step is to sear the salmon. I've had a high walled pan on medium high heat for a few minutes and adding a couple tablespoons of olive oil or avocado oil. And then we're gonna add the salmon skin side down and sear for about three to four minutes until golden brown. You're gonna know your salmon's ready to flip when it easily lifts off the pan. So I'm flipping the salmon and then I'm gonna sear for another three minutes on this side. I like my salmon medium rare to medium but it's really gonna depend on the thickness of your filet. For plating, we're gonna wanna conserve that crispy salmon skin that we worked so hard to get. So that's why I'm gonna put the sauce on bottom, place the salmon directly on top, skin side up, and then for garnish, gonna add a little slice of lemon and then a little piece of dill just to go on the sauce and then it's completed. If you guys like the video, please like and subscribe and I'll catch you in the next one.